Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Crashlands. We need to meet Barry at night, and that's where we're going. Also, I need one more Mega Watt Super Watt Essence uh, to upgrade my Watt, which will be really cool. Then he will be a brown Watt, and I will probably care more for him than right now. So. If I see one of those wats, I'm going to stop and attack it. But Barry Shrine is in here somewhere. So I will find it. Eventually. Oh, there's more things, more things. Here we go. Ooh, it's red and glowing all red. Okay. You three. We gather here to affect a change of powers. Thanks to Shaharasha, our newest Haifa, we turn this world over to Barry. Shaharasha, hand me Bulbai and Straddlebark, please. What? The herbs, Shaharasha, hand them to me quickly. Nah, I think I'll keep them. You will have to get through me to get to Marla. You better just stand down. Shaharasa! Why would you betray us? Your soul belongs to Barry. <laughs> oh man, you should see the look on your face, Shaharasa. Marla seems like a better bet for the all tendrum. Blast from her, my high fae. We cannot take her alone. We must sacrifice ourselves so that Barry may sporulate our bodies, our souls, for Barry. <laughs> Barry, you interfere, Flux Dames. You were to be my champion, the herald of the new era. We already have a boss, <laughs> the Bureau of Shipping. And we definitely don't need another one. Maybe you could work out like a part-time co consultancy station situation. Nope. I give full benefits plus medical. You know, but nope. Thanks though, Barry. Then you leave me no choice. I'm firing you. And just so Marla can't have you, I'll slay you as well. Oof. Oof. What are those? Oh, oh, look at him. Oh shoot, he's leaving like trails. Okay. This might, this is not gonna be fun. Get stunned. Oh. Okay. Oof, what are those? Not cool. Oh, come on. Get there. Oh. Get rocked. Boss fights. Ooh. Oof. Oh, I can't go up from there. Okay. Get stunned. Ouch. Keep that health full. Zigzag. Get him. Ooh, got him a good time. Oh, come on. There's a Zug down there, too. I don't want to anger him. Get boomeranged. Oof. Okay. More of those. Gets done. Get hit. Okay. Oh, I grabbed a wat. I don't want a wat in here. Get out of here. Oh, now's my chance. There. Get a couple good hits. I gotta get that wat out of here. Dang it. I need not destroy you, Flux. You would be a powerful ally. What if I throw in like 12 vacation days? Matching four, matching 401k? Mmm, no can do. Cuts into my squishy bottom line too much. No deal. Squee. Get strike. Eat it, eat it. Ooh, that was a good one there. 
Come on, up here. Bring it on, Barry. You spore. Uh. Uh. It's done. Oh. Alright, I have full health. Okay. Get. Okay. Nope. He's, nope. Now I don't have full health. Come on. Go. He's almost dead. Oh! One more hit. You got him. No! We could have been partners. The world bent around my will, channeled through your hands. Sorry, Barry. It's not us, it's you. Oh, I've always wanted to say this. Ahem. You're fired! <laughs> I'm, going to, I'm going to need some really intensive therapy after this. Shock prod. New schematic. Okay. Bat shoes? Okay. Voice of Murder. You have saved me! Flux Daves and perhaps all of the Savannah. Evil Eye. Ooh, I wonder what those are. Okay. He was nothing, really. Barry didn't seem like a very, ni very nice deity. Remind me not to get on your bad side, Flux. It is not every day that a deity incarnate is defeated by a mortal. I would like to make you my champion. That you may always walk with grace in the savannah. I'm honored, Marla. But I'll have to pass. You dismiss my glorious offer? Yeah, we've got our own set of rules to live by. Sweet of you to think of us, though. Well, at least let Dern shower you with material wealth. Return to Maripol and speak with her at once. And thank you again. I love how these guys, just, these wampets just kind of appeared. Okay. Whoops. Nope. Well. Alright, return to Maripol. <laughs> My running. <laughs> it's all black. Oh, uh, where is Maripol? Right here. Get defeated, Barry. Marla told us what you done. You defeated Barry. Yep. Spoken like a true tendrum. Marla wanted me to pass these on to you. May you grow ever upward. Zuglug essences and dusk shards. Nice. Okay. We got a couple new things. Let's go check what those are. I bet they're pieces of armor. They sound like pieces of armor. But I'm not 100% sure. Shock prod. It's a trinket. Okay, don't... This thing is shockingly good at shocking the socks off of things. Don't lick the tip. Grants a 10% chance on melee attack to deal electric damage. I can make that. I can make that. Okay. Um, shoes. Trinket as well. Increase run speed by 5%. That would be nice. Um, what was the other thing? Here we go. Furniture, evil eye. It stares into the soul of everything in the universe. I kind of want one of those things right now. As a memento of killing Barry. It, doesn't, it looks more like an olive, not an eye. Alright, let's place this thing. It stares into the soul of everything in the universe. Where are we going to put this thing then? We'll put it right over here. Once I find it. There it is. Oh, a berry trophy too. Alright, it's watching everything. It's watching over my base. And my lake. And my pets. I didn't find one of those big bats though. Dang it. Oh! I can make it. Oh, done. We're gonna upgrade the bat in one minute. What is juice box? Doesn't say anything right now. All right. Oh, and that's it. So Barry, I kind of want to go check out. I have one minute. I'm gonna go check out this coldest place over here since I have one minute. And uh, ooh, look, there's two of these guys. Um, where is she? Where is it? Oh, it's way over here. Yeah, I was gonna cheat and just kind of go right there. Okay. I no breaking through walls. There's no breaking through walls. 
Oh! Get attacked! Get stunned! I did just, yeah, I wanted to see kind of what was going on here. All those, I mean, those other guys technically sacrificed themselves, so I can't imagine anyone being here. Roots of Marla. Nice. But, uh, yep, nothing else. Nothing new. Oh. It's getting so big, this map. It's getting big. Alright. Alright, Wingnut. I need you. Poof. Time for an upgrade. Time for an upgrade. Bam. What? Wingnut is growing. Bing, 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 bing. He didn't really change other than his color. But that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Alright, I want you to follow me now. Because you attack fast. He attacks really quick. So, he may not hit as hard as like Kevin or Guz, but he attacks fast. And so I think that is a little advantage for him. All right. Now we go to the creeping rift. Since those other things are just trinkets, I'm not going to worry about them right now. But just hang tight and I'll be there sometime soon or unless something else happens. All right, I'm getting closer and closer. And I don't know what to expect. I don't know if I, it's going to be like a portal to a different world or if it's just going to be like a border throughout the like just like walking into a new biome just like this okay okay hello grandmammy just in time these stones are old older than the oldest tendrum stories yet we still know the words to open them up when paths do fray we part the way through grass frost and bone when you glad I didn't mess up that chant fickle it is just slap this old bog stone and you'll be on your way thanks grandmammy on the way over here I got to thinking I still owe Hugo a whooping and I think you two aren't as keen on that as just getting them boxes are aren't as keen on that as just getting them boxes I don't think Hugo will give us a choice we'll have to take him down either way I suppose that's true then on that we're settled Hugo must pay but I'll be coming along to make certain of it see you on the other side grandmammy you on top of it but no it looks like it's a portal it's a portal to a new world that looks squishy and worm filled Well, is this all Savannah? There's no way this is all Savannah. I guess I'll find out. Let's do it. Warping to bog. Unpacking biome, placing outposts. Ah, that was uncomfortable. I feel super weird right now. Ooh, that feeling takes me back. Careful around these parts. The bog isn't itself is one giant organism she gets a bit surly with newcomers one giant gross organism it looks even more disgusting than that video feed we saw earlier now be careful the bog can hear you you don't want to hurt her feelings creepy and bog you are the most beautiful slimy mushy thing that i've ever seen nice save juice box Everything here is so different. It doesn't seem like our current tools will be very effective. Back in the day, we were issued a bog trowel when doing recon missions. Pretty sure I remember how to make one. Requires a kiln. And a good amount of parts from these wild Voma around here. Why don't you get one of those put it together? Ooh, look at that dusk trowel. I'll make it. Alright, it's nighttime though, man. What is this thing? A jolly chomp and I don't know what this this thing is I don't a blue I need a blue 
All right, where's my map? It's a whole new... This is a whole new area. Jeez. Well, let's get our feet wet here. Feet wet. What is this? You need a trowel to pry this. Okay. You need a trowel to pry this. Well, I can't really do much without a trowel. But I need some of this stuff. Which I bet comes from this bad boy that's right here. This Voma. Get stunned. I don't know what to expect. Get. Oh, okay. That was three. Look how big this one is. Alright, Voma. Done. Alright, I need to kill a few more. Here we go. Here we go. Get stunned. I gotta watch. Oh, what was that? A bomb pole. I don't know what a bomb pole is. hurt as much as I thought they were gonna hurt though nothing I can't handle what is this though look at this kind of area this dark burnt area oh what are these need a better saw okay what about this thing I need a trowel okay I just need more Voma here we go I think I can do it I think I can do it what is this? Oh, I popped that. Wait, face panic mode. Oh, I'm like hunger. Not cool. But I can run fast. Okay. Okay, not cool. Oh, especially when there's a lot of them. Look at that, jeez. Get stunned. Okay, do I have enough? 18 out of 20. All right, this guy should do it. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, what the sneezes? That's enough. All right, can I teleport back to this guy? I can, which means I'm probably going to end up Yellowstone. I'm probably going to end up building a base focused around this Savannah Porter here. Sounds about right. Because what I'm probably going to need to do is move the majority of the stuff from this base over there. Yep. I'm going to probably do that as soon as I make this trowel. Because I'm going to have to make all these different tables again. Which, I mean, granted, it's not bad. I already have, I think, a couple of the beginner beginning tables. And from the beginning tables, you can make all the other tables. I think I have enough to be able to do it. And maybe I'll make a, a more detailed type room, base to base. You know, one room for this, one room for that. Um, but let's pop a trowel out. Dusk trowel. Dun dun dun. Tier 1 trowel. This trowel should come in handy for popping plants and several organisms out of the ground. That's what it's about. That's about it. Just kidding. That's about it. Do do do. Too integrated. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. What's so special about this thing? Seems kind of floppy. No idea. Floppiness doesn't seem very useful. We should ask Grandmammy. All right, to Grandmammy. Hello, Grandmammy. Uh, brings me back to my youth. The floppiness of it all. Uh, Grandmammy? Who's a what? Oh, I'm sorry, I was daydreaming. So what's so great about this trowel? Your old twos are crass, which ain't a problem for the Savannah. But you gotta treat the bog with some finesse so she don't get angry. I don't think this could get creepier, but clearly it can. I didn't think. Floppy tools are great in the bog, since you can harvest stuff without stressing her too much. You can use that rubbery trowel to pop them blues off the ground without hurting them. Like flipping a sawgrass pancake. Blues? Sawgrass pancake? Blues are them cute little glowy green things. Jolly chumps love to eat them. Though they can get, they get gas something terrible. I guess jolly chumps would be those squishy red mouth things. Yep, them poor gassy jollies explode after ingesting one of them blues. Scatter their parts all over. 
Biology is disgusting. You're all disgusting. Grandmammy, if our tools won't work here, what about my awesome weapons? Now your weapons will work just fine. Just don't go killing too many bog critters. The bog does love her children. Well, I guess no sleep for me tonight. Oh, but I do remember how to make a more bog friendly weapon. Get one of them going to see how she feels. Ooh, look at it. A vlammer. And I make it with that bad boy there. But I don't think I can make that thing just yet. Let's double check that and then we will we will end this episode here. And then I got to get all I got to get all my pets over there. I got to get everything going over there once I'm pretty sure I'm finished here. Yeah, so this guy's going to take a handful of I actually need to make some of these. I only needed one. Okay, that's one. More Vlap, uh, Jolly, I bet you, yep, you get them from Jolly Chomp after feeding them those bugs. Jolly, where do I get this from? Okay, well, spitting these balls of sticky, disgusting you predators. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm gonna work, I'm gonna work on making this guy and a new base. Uh, uh, between now and the next episode. Just so that I have everything up and running and you guys don't have to worry about the time spent of me making a base. I'll probably do a quick little tour of the base and then we will be all good. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you did like it, leave a like. It helps me. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next episode. It is. That's a smart move. <gasps> There's that key, though. I see you, key. Ooh. Is this a lug zug? It's a, uh, oh, it's a zug dug lug. That's right. That's what it is. Done.